My name is Bridget Hegarty and I run Girl Riders Folkestone. Skateboarding is such an amazing sport. Yeah, it's seen as an extreme sport, but you take it on the level that you want to experience it. The emphasis is on girls. It's not exclusive, so I'm not saying it's not for men or boys. Encouraging youngsters to do it because it's fun and encouraging every age to tap into it because it's really important to keep on having fun in life. It's amazing to see people encouraged and supported. That feeling, giving that opportunity and just say, hey, look, we're a group of people just all giving it a go and maybe experiencing some fear, but then getting over that and feeling the confidence that comes from the achievement of it all. When Folks in 51 starts, that's going to be probably the main arena to do the meetups. My name's Lawrence. I'm the chief executive of Shetway Sports Trust, who is the charity that will be managing and overseeing Folks in 51 once it opens. We're going to be catering for skateboarding, BMXing, scooting, boxing, climbing, bouldering, amongst other sports and activities as well. This is a huge, multi-million pound, international standard facility. This is obviously predominantly for local people, but we are absolutely hell-bent on getting the most elite skaters, elite BMXers and so on to come and experience this park. But also, I think it's quite unique in the sense that it's actually multi-storey. I don't think there's many parks at all around the world that can boast that. I am personally incredibly excited to use the facilities. As someone that grew up in Folkestone, skateboarding around the local area, I cannot wait for it to open. There's more and more extraordinary places hopping up all over the district for people to come, local people to use and enjoy, but also again, for those people coming to visit Folkestone, and it's only gonna keep on improving.